This is Chris Berry, the Idaho Painter, here in Boise, Idaho, bringing you another how-to video, and hopefully this will make your job go a little easier, smoother, and like a professional did it. This is Chris, the Idaho Painter, here in Boise, Idaho. It's a rainy day here in Boise, cold outside, so we're not doing any exterior painting today, so it's a good day to make a video. In this video, this is going to be part of my OSHA series, and this is in regards to respirators. Anytime you're actually on a job site and you're doing any type of spraying, whether it be latex, oil-based lacquers, etc., you definitely want to be using a respirator. It's required by OSHA, and you want to get those and provide them to your employees. The respirator, also you need to know that according to OSHA rules and regulations, it needs to be fit tested. And in order to be fit tested, you can't have any facial hair. So when the respirator is actually onto your face, it actually creates a good seal. So get those respirators fit tested. You need to have that documented. And then there's also two kinds of respirators or filters that I actually like using when I'm out there on the job site. Any type of latex products, I actually use a pink filter and it's a P100 3M filter and these filters just easily remove from your mask and the favorite mask that I like to use and all my employee, employees use is a 3M 7500 series mask and the actual model is and it states right on here it's a 7502 and I wear a medium mask and the mask itself easily adjustable it's easy to use the filters just twist on and off and if you're on a job site and you're using any type of oil based products or lacquer products you got to use an organic vapor filter so this particulate filter the p100 is good for latex paints and anything with just dust and no chemicals that you'll actually be inhaling so if you're going to be using oil based or lacquer based products or any other harsh chemicals get the organic uh, vapor filters and this is a 3M6001 model filter, and they install just as simply as these particulate filters. You just twist on and then twist off. And so, um, easily usable, easily adjustable, get them fit tested, make sure your employees have them, make sure they're using so you don't get cited by OSHA. This is Chris here in Boise, and this is my OSHA series, and this is some tips on using respirators. Thanks for watching our videos, and don't forget, when you're done watching, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like us, and share us.